going to march on down uh, to Pioneer Square to join in solidarity with the big peace demonstration that's going on today. Uh, the reason we're here is because we want to present an analysis of why the war is happening that's not just anti-war, but also confronting the root causes of that war, confronting uh, imperialism, confronting white supremacy, and confronting the capitalist system that feeds this war and every war. So uh, we're doing this today. We're doing this today in the spirit of solidarity, uh, and just be good to keep that in mind. We're not here to fuck shit up. We're not here to fight the cops. We're here to march as radicals down and join in solidarity with the rest of our comrades, who we may have different tactical, political differences with, but we are all one anti-war movement. So we're going to march there, down there, uh, in solidarity with our comrades and join the demonstration. Uh, all power to the people. Thank you for coming out today. Yeah. Look at this one more time in slow motion. Watch the kid holding the sign over his head. If you watch the corporate media, you probably heard this kid jumped up on a police car and then spit at the cops. Would they have just let him walk away after an assault like that? Why isn't he running away? Why isn't he looking over his shoulder? Clearly he had no idea he was about to be jumped by two police officers. If he had spit on them, wouldn't he have known?
We'll just have. No, but I don't. I, 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 I he doesn't want to talk. He doesn't want to talk. He doesn't want to talk. He doesn't
after that, the rest of the march just seemed somehow empty and pointless. I mean, it was good that so many people came to the streets, but what were they there for? If we couldn't stand together in that tangible moment of everyday oppression on our own streets, how will we ever stand together in the face of what's to come? for the street anymore, so people need to move out of the street. What happens if they don't? Then, then we'll help them move. And so, I don't want to have a standoff about something that is very silly at this point, but people need to just move. A standoff over something very silly? Yeah, we need to open the street up for traffic. But do you see our point that the traffic is, is sucking down the oil and that's what the war is all about? Okay, if that could, that statement can be made from the sidewalk, that would be terrific.